I'm sorry, your feet are so cute, I can't even <laughs> go back. Hey guys, Lexi here, and well, welcome to our 2017 spring training house. You guys asked for the Cribs edition, well, I'm about to give it to you. Really quickly, fun fact, a pina found me this house. So I'm super excited to show it to you guys, so come on in. Before you come in, I ask you to take off your shoes and of course, wipe your feet on the pina mat. Uh, I'd like to welcome you into our formal living room. Um, this is a room that Hunter and I once in a while sit in. But I will say this, every time I've sat in here, I have serenaded Hunter. Just kidding, it was on. <laughs> That's how much. That's right, Hunter gets that every night, guys. So we have a fireplace, a not working fireplace, but um, it's nice to look at. Then we're gonna move on over to the casual living room. Now this is where Hunter and I really like to kick our feet up and relax. Uh, this couch is very, very comfortable. It's not good for long hours of lounging around because it's sunken in, but it's still a good couch. Uh, we definitely relax here a lot. This is probably where we spend a lot of our time. But this is nice, it has a big screen TV, a nice uh, table that no one can reach and put their drinks on. Last year, we only had one fireplace. This year, we have two. Pretty awesome, we're coming up in the world, guys. Our home wouldn't be complete without our Nintendo Switch, but we haven't played it yet. We just haven't had the time to. But it's plugged in, charged, ready to go for that special moment. A special feature to this uh, casual living space is this wine cooler. Clearly don't utilize at all. <laughs> now I'm gonna take you up to Hunter's man cave. And this is where he gets his mind right for the season. Awesome couch here to relax on. He's got a big screen TV, a big desk right here. Like his computer's already up for gaming. But he doesn't use the computer chair. I don't know why, maybe it's for clients. I don't know what clients he has. <laughs> He's got his own private bathroom and his own man cave. Check it out. This bathroom is literally only big enough for Hunter. Now I'm gonna take you to the second place that we spend most of our time. This is where we eat majority of our meals. This is usually where everyone tends to gather as well if we're playing a board game. Here's our kitchen, we got a great island. These chairs are pretty comfortable as well. That is great island. Grapefruit, like fresh grapefruits from the grapefruit tree outside. I get to have one, but apparently they're good. Our guests have told me so. Another fun fact that Matt can show me also for me, he put salt on a tart slash bitter grapefruit. It makes it easier to eat. Fun fact. Of course, the refrigerator. Fully stocked with LaCroix, Essentia, and kombucha. And also, don't forget our meals that are freshly made by Matt. Next room is our formal dining room that we've only used once with friends. Uh, eating pizza, actually. Because <clears throat> it fits everyone. That's why we have it. <laughs> now, for our super secret room that not everyone knows about, and I'm gonna show it to you guys. And usually only me or Hunter use it. Are you guys ready for this? It's another bathroom. <laughs> I know what you're thinking. You probably thought it was a closet. Oh, it's a closet. A water closet. This is probably the room that I get ready in because it's the only room that has a long mirror like so. This bed's actually pretty comfortable. It's pretty cool. There's a TV in here. What's that to love about this room? It's very uplifting, this room. Here's the piece of artwork that uh, Corey Guerin and his beautiful fiance, Maddie, gave to us as a wedding gift. I love it, I cannot wait to bring it back to this go, but this time we're gonna keep it safe. Oh, flawless fishes. I guess only one fish wants to come out to play today. Here is the purple room's bathroom. This is where I like to do a lot of my hair because I feel like the lighting in here is a lot better, it's a lot bigger, I can take all the counter space and not hear Hunter um, yell at me about it. A seat so I can work on my sickness. 
All right, now the room you all been waiting for where the magic happens. This is it, guys. This is where Hunter and I sleep. I just kind of fluff the bed together <laughs> because I feel like you and I are at a more comfortable stage in our relationship where I can show you the real me, the real us, <laughs> the real Hunter. The lovely gifts my sweet love leaves for me during laundry day. Michelle and Chris gave to us as a little gift. How sweet is that? Hunter has all of these. Ooh. <laughs> Ooh. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Do you think he has a rock problem? Yeah, he's probably stuck between a rock and a hard place. Can't choose which one he wants. One weird thing about this bathroom is how small the toilet is. So small. Hunter can barely fit in there. This is where we store our suitcases because it's just kind of a weird closet. But look at this closet. So spacious for both Hunter and I. Um, yeah, and of course our closet wouldn't be complete with Magic the Gathering cards. I don't know what he's doing over here, like hoarding them, I don't know. There's a whole other wing that I haven't even shown you guys. So guys, now we're on the other side of the house. This is where our guests stay. So, in this bedroom, guest bedroom number one, this bedroom, <laughs> comes equipped with a bed, a window and a chair, and a closet. Here is the office. This is the official office, not the made up office that Hunter has upstairs. <laughs> this is the office office, and this is where all our big deals are made. Nice sturdy desk, because all good deals are made on a sturdy desk. Uh, also comes with a closet for your secretary. This is where here is the second guest bedroom. Comes equipped with towels. This house has so many dry closets, it's like unbelievable. You can tell people just to use the bathroom from here. Bada bing, we're in the backyard. Has a barbecue, so sometimes Matt from Show Meals comes over and just barbecues for us. It's awesome. A jacuzzi, which is really nice. It only takes four hours to heat up. But I'm not sure if you guys remember from last year, I bought this hammock. In our other in our other spring training house, and I still have it. And Hunter loves to sit here in the morning and meditate. Also, we've learned how to play croquet. Look at that, you guys! I'm practically a pro over here. Hunter and I like to swing here together, and we like to watch the sunset. It's really romantic, guys. Alright, now for our cars. I'm driving uh, the Ford Expedition this year. Uh, I like it. It's a little smaller than the car I had last year, which I kind of like because I can find more parking. It's not tricked out with anything. <laughs> but it does have tinted windows, and I feel cool with tinted windows. And then we've got Hunter's car. He's driving a Hyundai Sonata. He wanted to have this car because he thinks that I am not a good enough driver to drive a smaller car and he thinks I'm safer in the bigger car, so he decided to take the smaller car. <laughs> he looks really big in it, but hey, he likes it. What can you say? Well guys, you've seen my cars, you've seen the way Hunter stores his clothes, and you've seen inside my fridge. What more could you guys possibly want to see? Well, look, you don't have to go home, but you can't stay here. Why? Because, well, we're leaving in two weeks. We're headed back to San Francisco. So, I'll see you guys in the chat. Bye! If you guys like this video, go ahead and hit that like button. Also, let me know in the comments below which was your favorite room. Also, if you haven't subscribed to the channel yet, subscribe. Bye!